today there is no way we talk about international development in the whole global south without talking about the influence of China. And therefore, it's very important for the international civil society to understand more about this topic and know how to engage the Chinese players. Everyone should be focusing on China's influence in the world. It's already reshaping how the world works uh, and uh, yeah, any kind of impact we want to have has to be based on what the world is like. Really identifying and acknowledging their growing power and role as part of our overall analysis and identifying entry points I think is a really important thing for international organizations to consider um, and to consider collectively. Business has learned that you can't just do business with China, whether it's in your own country or whether it's within China, in the normal way. And I think we need to understand that as well. It's a different way of working. Right now, there's very little understanding, no matter from civil society outside China or civil society inside China, regarding like who are the Chinese in the global south, what are they doing, like how to engage them and so on. It's important to build an image that civil society actually could help mediate the conflict and fill the gap of understanding of China, about China. A civil society in China is underdeveloped, so I think the international civil society could bring a lot of experience and expertise to uh, the growth of that in the country. China will change and will have to evolve with it. The shift for us will be accommodating that um, in a way that doesn't, uh, that both has an impact um, but doesn't give away a load of things that make us special uh, as well.